we take our eight-legged whore back to the village, where Mr. Paul's cousin shows me her recipe for Cambodia's favorite snack. Great stove. After killing the tarantulas and boiling them in salted water for a couple of minutes, they're simply deep fried in hot oil. Jesus Christ, they're crispy, aren't they? Finger licking tarantula. After a few minutes, they're ready for eating. Look at that. Oh, dear. And the whole village has turned up to see how the Westerner likes their local speciality. The moment we've all been waiting for. OK. How it tastes? Yeah. Mm. Mm. It's mm. good. Mm. <laughs> I'm glad they're happy. <laughs> <laughs> After the legs, Mr. Paul shows me the part of the tarantula that is most highly prized by the true connoisseur, the belly. Yeah, the belly, yeah. Full of something? Yeah. yeah. Full of pus. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I've eaten some weird things in my time, but I'm really not sure about this. Uh, bitter? Uh, yeah, it's very bitter. <laughs> uh, can I just say I prefer the legs? <laughs> Weird texture when you're biting into it first off. It's like, mmm, crunchy chicken thigh, mmm, delicious. Bite through it and all of a sudden, poof, burst of sweetness. Then it's the body and it's like a sort of bitter, bile, sour taste. It's been a long day. After I said my goodbyes, I hit the road. As surprising as it was, I don't think I'll be putting tarantula on the menu for the royal dinner. <laughs>